Welcome back to episode 5 of Geometry Dash. Today we'll be doing Niflheim. I am really, really excited for this. This level is one of the most fun extreme demons, in my opinion. As a reward for completing Sekupen Hell, which was the most miserable experience I've ever had, I decided to play something actually enjoyable. I have wanted to beat this for a long time, it just, the memory is kind of a pain in the ass. So instead of putting it off this whole time, I decided, fuck it, I'll learn the memory. And it, it took a while, it, it's kind of a pain in the ass to learn, but I've learned how to do it, I'm pretty consistent at it, and I'm ready to give this a shot. So let's just do this now. Oh, it feels so nice not to play Sakoop in Hell, I hate that level so much. So, as I said, this level is kind of a pain in the ass to learn. I would almost call it a memory demon, it's really heavy on the memory. There are two parts which are kind of a pain in the ass, that being the ball and the 40% cube. That, that part's just generally bad. But everything else is fairly enjoyable. The drop, playing from the drop is insanely fun. This level is not that hard, it's not kind of on the easier end of extreme demons. I just need something enjoyable after playing Sukup in Hell. That, I nearly freaking quit this game. This shouldn't take me that long to beat, at all. I've practiced much more than I have to, and I'm fairly consistent at even the hardest part of the level. Here we go. Onto the ball, wow. See if I could do this first try. Nope. Not at all. Yeah, the ball is not very enjoyable. It's actually totally fine gameplay-wise, it just drags on for much longer than it has to. I still take this over like 90% of the other extreme demons any day. This is so much fun. Oh, come on. Well, that's the hardest part of the ball right there. I don't know why, but I'm horribly inconsistent at that part. It's just three clicks, but I'm awful at them. Everything else, I'm totally fine, but that part, no. Here we go. And I fucked it up immediately, nice. <sighs> Nice job. Jesus Christ. Really? For fucking Christ. It's not that hard, I'm just really dumb. Look at how small that spike is. Look at how much space I have. What are the chances of hitting that? Well, that was expected. This is the last shitty part of the level. This part's just really shitty to play. I'm gonna die there a lot, aren't I? No. What the hell happened there? Here we go. I fucked it up immediately. No. Fucking what? This duel is dumb. What did I expect? I so knew I was gonna die there. That part's really unpredictable. <sighs> There's a bug there, for those of you who don't know. What? Come 
on. I barely fucking clicked. Uh, this level's dropping from like a 9 out of 10 to like an 8 out of 10. And it's still dropping. This is just getting so boring, dude. The ball just drags on forever. Fucking god damn it. I'm losing focus. This is so boring. This level just drags on. It takes like eight years to get to the drop. Ah, oh, come on. So fucking. Uh, this level is so fucking janky as hell. Yeah, nice. Nice. Beautiful. Fucking, fucking beautiful. Oh my god. You fucking asshole. Oh my god, I... <laughs> this fucking level is so fucking boring! <sighs> I'm so fucking tired of this... Ah. Uh... This, this is so fucking boring. Please. Holy shit, did I just fluke that? How much did I fluke that from? Yeah, I need to see how much I fluked. I think I fluked it from 67%, I'm not sure. Well, thank god that's over. At least that didn't take too long. So, the level's not bad. Like I said, it was pretty fucking boring. It's not that boring, I was just really impatient. Like I always am. It's not that bad of a extreme demon. If you could look past the stupid ball in the pre-drop, it's not bad. Like I said, it's not that hard, though it's not that many attempts. So, total, 8,649. It could have been a lot less, I just took all that time to learn the janky gameplay and the stupid bugs that came with it. I mean, this level's not bad. 
There are some parts which are kind of a pain in the ass, like the ball and the pre-drop. But once you learn them, it's not bad. It's not bad at all.